Okay, we're going to go into X-Plane and look at that program. Of course, it takes a while to load. Okay, so now we're into X-Plane. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go up to Aircraft. We're going to go ahead and uh, open Aircraft. Go up into our Aircraft. We're going to go down to Light Sport. And we're going to go into... I haven't actually tried the Sonics, so we're going to open that aircraft right now and see what we got. Here we're looking at the Sonics aircraft. Here's our 2D view. Going to our 3D view. Go look at the back of the aircraft. We're going to get a little closer here. And then we're going to pan around. Look at the ailerons. Look at the elevator. Now we're going to look at the rudder. Back to our instrument panel. Of course, we can look down. Okay, let's look at some of the other uh, areas here. Go through the menus here. File. We can load situations. Okay, we've gone into aircraft. Now we can, uh, if we want to look at the, we've got different liveries, different paint jobs we can look at. We can uh, go in to look at weight and fuel. Now here's the uh, empty weight. Okay, and we we've got our payload weight is 217. We can add we can add up here. We can see at the bottom it it gains, and our total weight down here, um, total, and our total fuel down here. We can add. We've got 47 pounds. It's not much. 70 pounds, and as now we can see our max gross weight here is 1,006. Maximum allowable weight is saying that this is 1150. So we've got our weight and fuel. Up to aircraft, we can do equipment failures, um, different aircraft situations. Now, now we go into locations, so we can um, select global airport. Now, this is where we can go into the different uh, airports. Now, say for instance, if we want to do a three nautical mile final approach. We hit three. Okay, there we are. We are in our three nautical mile approach. Kind of nice to be able to set up already to be able to accomplish that. So we're going to go back up. Aircraft. Okay, we're at location. Environment. Let's go to the weather. Okay, now here's where we can determine our cloud tops, weather, visibility. Um, it's easiest to right here put our visibility high, precipitation light, and turbulence at none. Now we can change how that weather, we can change the weather and we can also get different wind layers here if we so wish. Radar summary. Get out of weather here. Uh, environment date and time, settings, data input. Now this is where it's, it's very interesting here. We can look at our frame rate, we can look at our speeds, Mach number. Now we can set these uh, so that we can see them on the screen. Cockpit during flight, internet via. Now and this shows you whichever box you check, it tells you where you'll, you're going to see that. So cockpit during flight. So say, for instance, if we want to see the actual throttle uh, and, oh, let's just say our speeds. Okay. Now when we're flying, what we have is up in the top here, we've got that, that information. Throttle up, throttle down. And as you can see, we're headed in for landing here, and we can see our data up in the 
up in the screen. Settings, okay, and we can go into joystick. Okay, now here's where we can set our different uh, uh, joysticks and pedals. Okay, we can see that right toe brake, left toe brake, we've got our yaw, our roll, and our pitch. And we can set these different different things here. We can also go into our buttons to set our buttons how we how we want our buttons to work. This of course shows your keys. You can set different keys. Okay, settings, uh, rendering options. Now this is where we go in and set our screen. Uh, and if to make it look more accurate or speed it up. And as you can see for our, our screen size, texture resolution, all of our settings here. The buttons I have is one button goes in back. Another button actually shows exactly where you are. This is handy as far as looking at where you are in relation. And of course you've got different options here. You can go in tighter and here you can see where we started and our path going on in.